since this is clearly uh, something that I that I love, you know, so near and dear to my heart, but I, I'm a little upset that I don't have the opportunity to talk on a wireless mic. It's like we're throwing this back to the 1980s or something. I mean, ladies and gentlemen, at this time, allow me to introduce a man who I can happily say now is officially the president of the World Wrestling Federation, Gorilla Monsoon! fans here winning here tonight the first ever fantasy draft hello welcome into the broadcast position grill him on soon alongside the handsome jimmy hansen you have certainly outdone yourself again Would you stop? really that happened already today you couldn't have waited well this is interesting a fantasy draft definitely the first uh, first ever here in the rwa and uh Makes us more innovative than most companies. Well, I mean, we are an innovative bunch. There's no doubt about that, my friend. And you know very much about uh, about uh, fantasy drafts, and whether it be football, baseball, or any other sort of uh, fantasy draft. I may know a little something about something. If you're too embarrassed, we can pick somebody else. So there are two fans there that will be picking... Uh, Two different teams of four for RWA Thanksgiving Throwdown. Okay. Well, Daria won. I mean, fantasy fantasy drafts. I'm all about that. I mean, right now I'm six and zero in fantasy. Looking to go seven and zero on the week, my friend. Michael Sin. Michael Sin. Drafted number one here in the fantasy draft. I hate that guy. Right, Chico. Now, Peggy, who? Rocky gets a pick one. Shut up, Shut up, Shut up, Shut up, And her pick is Davy Cash. 
Davy Cash. Davy Cash drafted number two, so. Very interesting picks on one and two. Yes. Oh, come on! you know the uh, the sports betting for the uh, uh, for the Thanksgiving throwdown is still active still active still active uh, we have a lot a lot of people that have already come in and already have made their picks uh, a five dollar investment if you pick the winner it gets you a free gift card you know I heard the Cincinnati Reds have a problem with uh, gambling issues the uh, Cincinnati Reds why are you bringing up the Cincinnati Reds you're talking about sports betting and this crowd is very big on the one fall In our WA debut here in just a moment as Ace Romero will be coming out. Devil stance? Really? Comes out to my team! This is my team! Well, Jimmy Hansen is very upset about his team being used, one of 4,012. Who is this guy? Ace Romero, RWA debut. Yeah, thanks a lot. I can read a name, too. 280, Gorilla. 285 from Hell's Kitchen, New York. Hey, Devil Stamp, really? Sooner or later, they're going to start picking teams in because they Well, Jimmy Hansen has had more number one hits than the Billboard charts. No, I did not. Three. He's a very large fella. Coming to the ring. That is a that is a large fella. He's a loop. Where does he come from? Hell's Kitchen. Hell's New Kitchen, York? New York. What is, what is your... That's a big guy. And he's gonna be taking on another big guy, an RWA veteran here. In just a minute, we'll send it back up to Lucy Santana. Crowd goes insane for a terrific Tommy Trainwreck as he comes out to face this large undertaking in the RWA debut of Ace Romero. Well, Ace Romero is a big dude. Tommy Trainwreck, also of a large fellow, 255 in his own right. Well, I mean, Ace Romero looks like, looks like size-wise, I mean, it's just a... He's a massive man. And Manny Souza has his hands full in our opening contest. Ace Romero being inspected by our official. We are not sure if Ace Romero will be eligible for the Thanksgiving throwdown on November 15th. Well, I mean, this has been... I mean, this may be an interesting, uh, an interesting match that they have here. And Where's he going? I think he's calling a timeout. The match hasn't even started yet. And Ace Romero came out and very quickly looked like he was ready to wrestle. Now he's uh, taking a moment or two. Rainwreck gets in the face of Ace Romero. Crowd here at the Jump Shop once again. Ace Romero back in the ring. Looks like he's finally ready to wrestle. Ace Romero, definitely a large fella. Collar and elbow tie up. Tommy Trainwreck at the side headlock. Side headlock, Colin. That may not be the best idea for Tommy Trainwreck. Tommy Trainwreck may want to use the speed in this match. 
Tommy chain wreck very, very deceptively fast. The Rosewood train wreck and a shoulder That's block. Nobody shoulder moves. Block. Wow. The immovable object. The irresistible force meeting the immovable object oh, in the center of the ring. Thanks, thanks, for, thanks for calling that, bro. Appreciate that. Train wreck off the ropes again. Romero follows and Romero shoulder tackles. Tommy train wreck right to the mat. Off the ropes again. Train wreck deceptively flats his head and then Seguri finds the mark. Train wreck letting up Romero with four arms. Romero, just look at the strength and the power. Train wreck using that speed again, a wow. drop kick. See, finds I told the mark. you. I told you. Tommy Trainwreck very, very fast. Very, very fast for a man his size. Yeah, Trainwreck getting the crowd on the side, now mounting Ace Romero in the corner, laying in the fists right to the side of the cranium. And uh -oh. Romero. What is he doing here? He Look at the looking strike. for a power bomb. Trainwreck could be going right into oh. the corner. A power bomb. The back of its cranium hits the top turnbuckle. That could damage the cerebellum. What the? <laughs> oh, that was good. That was good. You've really been doing your research. Oh, Ace Romero's beaten down. Oh, Tommy Trainwreck, though, no joke. Laying in the forearms once again, and now trying to deadlift Ace Romero, and I don't think that's going to happen as Romero just tosses it to the other side of the ring. Romero looks like he's going to go for a knife edge chop. That's a nice hard chop. Romero not making many friends with the crowd here. Another chop. As Trainwreck tries to walk away and escape, goes Romero into the corner and now lighting up Romero with the chops. Oh, Tommy Trainwreck going for it again. Oof. Can't do it, Romero. Just too heavy. Into the corner goes Trainwreck. Romero gonna splash. Hits a big splash. Off the ropes again. Incoming. Trainwreck ducks out of the way. A cannonball misses the mark. I used to do that move. A long time ago in a land far, far away. One of the moves that might have put you out of your uh, career. Oh, thanks there. a lot. Really appreciate that. At least I had a career. Yeah. What do you get to say about that? I didn't think so. Ace Romero, though, trying to get back to his feet. Tommy Trainwreck already on his feet. Trainwreck goes for a clothesline. Nobody home. And another one, Romero does not move once again. This man is just so strong. A clothesline. End over end goes Tommy Trainwreck. And he's back up. The adrenaline now rushing. Another huge clothesline. Finally takes down Ace Romero. Ace Romero, definitely a big guy. Tommy Trainwreck keeps... Oh, my he's God. He's got him up. Ah! And sends him right down. Here's a cover. One, two, and Romero wow. gets out. That was the first pinfall of the matchup. Wow, Tommy Trainwreck really showing some intestinal fortitude there, Gorilla. Trainwreck going to the second rope. Measuring Ace Romero. Romero is dazed and confused. Here comes Trainwreck incoming. Romero catches him. Belly to belly overhead suplex. Both men down. Standing 10 count being administered. Romero the first to stir. Tommy Trainwreck staggered after that belly-to-belly -belly dropped him right on the point of his head. Romero climbing onto the apron now. Very dangerous positioning there. Double underhook from the arm. Trainwreck with a kick right to the side of the head. And a drop kick now. Trainwreck. Oh! A neck breaker on the... Apron it's like an ace crusher almost. Send Romero right to the right to the floor. And now Trainwreck has a difficult task of trying to get Ace Romero back into the ring. Romero back into the ring. 
Train wreck follows, and here's a cover. One, two, and it's just a kick. Wow. Just it, too. Manny Souza says he got up. Close. Very close. An eyelash. His crowd disagreeing with Manny Souza's call. Shot right to the midsection as Romero tries to stagger, and now he's double underhook Tommy Trainwreck. Looks like he's going for a capture suplex. Here's a cover. One, two, and Romero kicks out again. Trainwreck with a super kick right to the point of the jaw. Tick tock oh! hits the mark. And that should be it. One, two, Tommy Trainwreck wins this one. And what an impressive outing, albeit in a losing fashion for Ace Romero. The large man from Hell's Kitchen really took it to terrific Tommy Trainwreck. Well, I mean, what are you supposed to do, though? He comes in here, you know, uh, an unknown guy in the RWA, comes in and tries to wrestle one of the top superstars in the RWA. I mean, what do you expect to happen? Ace Romero, I think may have a future here in the RWA. He needs to get a little more seasoning under his belt uh, in terms of learning how the RWA style works. This is unlike any other wrestling promotion in the world. You can't just walk in here day one and expect to be a winner. 